Hello everyone! I know, probably crazy to see me wearing black, but today we are going to be trying TikTokers' favorite foods and foods that just have looked so good that I want to try that I've seen on TikTok. It's a rainy day out, so we're feeling cozy. Got a beanie, warm clothes on. I'm out of breath because I literally just ran up the stairs because I kind of want to do this before the sun goes down. So let's go. We're at Starbucks because it is the closest place to me out of everywhere else because we're kind of been gonna be going on a mission. We're gonna try the cookie butter Starbucks drink and it they say it tastes exactly like Trader Joe's cookie butter so let's see. Okay I'm sad they're out of oat milk. I so I got almond milk because I feel like that is a good substitution but I don't think it's gonna taste as good because almond milk is well I mean oat milk I think is better. Well we'll see. And while we try it I'm going to have to charge my car. I'm at 62 miles. Today is kind of gonna be an adventure because we have to drive all over. We have to drive all over to find these things. It's gonna be an adventure. Thank you. We have secured the bag. We have the drink here. So the drink is a, how you order it, a iced chai tea with oat milk and brown sugar syrup. Usually you get it with oat milk, but they didn't have any. So we are gonna try it. Oh, oh man. Oh my god! They were not lying when they said it literally tastes like cookie butter from Trader Joe's. If you have not had cookie butter from Trader Joe's, you will not know what I'm talking about. But if you do, it tastes exactly like it. Like, they are not lying. Wow, that's actually amazing. What the heck? I gotta do this on TikTok. Cause I'm also making a TikTok of this. So if you want to follow me on TikTok, my TikTok's at Leah Ash. And I'm gonna sit here while my car charges. And then the next stop is going to be Dunkin' Donuts to try the Charlie drink. Today we're gonna be amped up on caffeine. I don't typically drink caffeine, but uh, this is my second chai tea of the day. I made one at home. Oh, it's gonna be an interesting day. Sneak peek, oh my God, there's a bug in here. Get out, get out, oh. How did a bug get in here? I just, I don't, I don't kill bugs, so get out. I was just trying to show a sneak peek of my TikTok. Here it is, a little sneak peek, a little behind the scenes. A, okay, there's a car pulling in a charge, so go watch my TikTok and tell me if you come here for my video. The lighting is about to get so bad right now, but I don't know if it's a bad idea to go to Chick-fil-A because I feel like all the people are going to be going there, so I'm thinking instead of Dunkin' because I need some food. I want to go to Chick-fil-A because apparently Addison Rae is like obsessed with Chick-fil-A fries. She tweeted saying CEO of Chick-fil-A fries. So today I'll be the CEO of Chick-fil-A fries. And I'm gonna try. Well, I've had Chick-fil-A fries, but it's been actually probably a year. So it's the first time this year that I'm having Chick-fil-A fries. I really love French fries, so that'll be good. And I feel all this caffeine hitting me. So I need something before I have the Charlie version two at Dunkin' Donuts. Let's go, it's gonna take me 22 minutes. The sun might go down. Just need to vent. My visors don't do anything. I'm literally driving with the sun right in my face. Like that's not dangerous. Okay, we made it to Chick-fil-A and the line is crazy. If you live somewhere that has an in and out you would understand the struggle because it's exactly like in and out vibes right now. Like it like wraps around the entire restaurant. So see how long it takes to get some Chick-fil-A fries and we'll see if it's worth it because I haven't had Chick-fil-A fries in a minute. So is it gonna be worth waiting in this line and driving like 30 minutes? We'll see. I gotta put on my mask because I'm actually approaching quite fast. That actually was not bad at all. Now I'm just waiting to get my food and there's like probably like six cars in front of me. Not bad, not bad. I'm impressed, Chick-fil-A. Let's see if they say my pleasure. Cause that's what everyone does when they go to Chick-fil-A. They're like, oh, they said my pleasure. And then it's like a cute moment. Oh my gosh, I can't believe how fast this was. There was like a million cars. Guys, I should have kept recording because I'm not even at the front and they gave me my food. They walked over here and gave me the food. That's so cool. Cause my biggest pet peeve is cold food. They give it to your car before you even get to the window. Like what? Also an update, they did indeed say my pleasure. All right, I made it. I came to another charging station because, ooh, lots of napkins. I gotta get home. And I thought it, it was like right down the street, so it's perfect. So let's try the Chick-fil-A fries. I got ranch and ketchup, but I'm gonna try them plain. Oh, this car. He's gonna park right next to me. Mmm! 
these two are not the best combination. You kind of want something like Sprite or Coke or water when you're eating things like this. They're pretty good, but they're a little hard. But you know, let's let's try it with ranch. Try it with Chick-fil-A ranch. Nails make everything so difficult, I swear. ASMR, ready? I can't even open up a Chick-fil-A ranch, apparently. All right, let's try it. <laughs> Much better. Their ranch is pretty good. I can't complain, honestly. I'm gonna try it with their ketchup too. I feel like I'm getting my lipstick all over my face. And let's not squeeze. Oh, too much ketchup. You know, I see why she likes these. They're pretty good. I'm gonna dip it in the ranch. I think I, I like the ranch more than I like the ketchup. I feel like my channel is turning into a mukbang channel. Fun fact, I love watching mukbangs so much. So it feels really fun to actually do one myself because I'm a consumer of this type of content. Back when I had just moved to Washington, I didn't really have many friends because I just moved there. I felt really lonely. I watch mukbangs all the time before Nikocado Avocado, you know, or his channel is what it is now. Trisha Paytas, Zach Choi ASMR, Steph Papas. I think her name was Missy. Mishi, something like that. If any of you are feeling the way that I did, I hope that this comforts you. It makes you feel like you have a friend to eat with. Are you guys eating right now? Do you have a snack with you? Mm-hmm. Because that's why I loved watching these types of videos. It felt like I was eating with someone. And we're almost done. I'd give these like a, a 7.5 out of 10. I don't know why. I feel like the last time I had them, they were better. Also, remember when I mentioned it was raining? It somehow decided to stop raining and the sunset is pink. It looks beautiful. Okay, I have one left. All right, I'm really thirsty now. So I got my car back up to 100 miles, <laughs> which is funny. So I'm gonna stop charging and let's go to Dunkin' to try Charlie's drink. So it's my second time at this Dunkin' in a while. The last time I was here, I was trying the Velvet Macchiato. The last time I was here, they said, welcome to Dunkin', what do you want? <laughs> This time, they said the same thing. They're like, Duncan, what do you want? I'm like, okay, all right. So I ordered the drink. Let's see if it's good. I've also heard people talking about that new avocado toast, but honestly, it does not look good at all. No offense, Duncan, love you. But whenever I get Duncan or not, whenever I get avocado from Starbucks, the guacamole, oh my God, what just happened? Whenever I get guac from Starbucks, it's so bad. Like, I'm sorry, I just don't like that. Mm -mm. Okay, it's getting dark officially, but we have the Charlie drink here. Here. Does that need to be mixed? I can't tell. I think it looks pretty good. They gave me a straw to use and that's what it looks like. It has cinnamon, it has cinnamon sugar on top. So it's a cold brew with three pumps of caramel, sweet cream, cold foam, and cinnamon sugar on top. So let's rate the Charlie drink out of 10. Are you supposed to drink it without the straw? Whoa, okay. <laughs> okay, if you like the taste of coffee, it's really good. But it's very, very, very strong. If you like the taste of coffee, you could taste that up in there. I think that's because it's a cold brew. I don't typically drink cold brews ever. I'm very, very, very sensitive to caffeine. So I don't go for things like this. But if you like it, I'd say it's really good. I like the sweet cold foam on the top with the cinnamon sugar. It's pretty good. I, I feel bad rating it because I don't drink cold brew. But I'd probably say it's like a 6 out of 10. But if you like coffee, it could be a 9 out of 10. It's all perfect personal preference. I think it tastes kind of watery. It tastes a little watery today, but props to Charlie for having her own drink at Duncan. I think that's so cool. If any boba places want to give me my own boba drink, no, I'm just kidding, but I think that's super awesome. I think Charlie's a really good role model for young kids, and she, what is she, like 16 years old? The And I feel like she gets so much hate from people, and she doesn't deserve that. She's a 16-year-old. She's learning, and I think she's doing amazing. So there's the tea on that, which is, this is a funny transition to the next person. So, um, as I said earlier, I watch a lot of mukbangs and in all of my favorite mukbangs are eating Korean cheese dogs. So I'm going to be eating Korean cheese dogs today. And I am inspired by Trisha Paytas. She is the TikToker I'm going to be eating like right now. I don't eat any meat. Well, I have, I'm pescatarian, but I rarely have fish. I haven't been eating it too often. So I don't like any with the meat in it, but I'm going to get the mozzarella cheese dogs and try that today. But I have had them before, but it's been a while again. They used to be one of my fave foods. And when I would go visit LA, I would always get one. It's it's the same exact shop that she goes through. It's where the, all the mukbangers in LA go to. So I'm gonna go, hopefully they're still open. I'm like nervous because it is getting late. We're kind of on an adventure. So we're gonna head on down and see if we can get them. Okay, bye. There's the menu. 
We really went on a whole adventure together today. We got the food. So I got myself a cheese dog and I got amber cheese dog and then we got the uh, fish pastries with Oreo. OMG! Oh, oh my land. Wait, where's the fish pastries? Okay, they're right here. They are in this bag right here. Fish pastries. Okay, let me just close this because I don't want Ambers to get cold. These might be a little hard to eat. They're huge. That is what they look like. They're ginormous. We'll see if it's bussing. <laughs> I'm gonna have to clean my car after this. Are we ready? Hot. Oh my God. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. And we're eating it just like Trisha would because she eats it super plain. I like my stuff super plain too. So look at all the cheese on the inside. It won't, doesn't want to take the focus off of me. Excuse me. Mm. Mm hmm. Cheese pull. Hello, lady. You staring at me with your dog? Mm. These are so good. Oh my gosh. The cheese just does not stop, it just keeps coming. It's like a so good. I love cheese dogs. Mm. We're going to keep eating it. Ah! Mm. Oh my gosh, I look crazy right now. I eat like a chipmunk. It's so much cheese, but what do you expect? A rice mozzarella dog. And I'm in a random parking lot right now. What are you gonna do with all that cheese? All the cheese in your mozzarella dog. Uh oh, I taste a little batter. It's not cooked all the way. I taste a little batter. I need to try the fish pastries now. This is what they look like. They're Oreo on the inside. <gasps> Hello. I'm so sorry. I'm such a bad YouTuber. Okay, ready? This is so good. Oreo is one of my favorite things ever, so that is just so amazing. I worry that this is gonna be too long of a video, so I don't wanna like eat everything on camera. I wanted to get the first few bites with you guys. I wanna make sure Amber gets her food while it's hot. If you wanna see more mukbangs on my channel, me trying food, me doing food challenges, I would actually love to do that. So just comment down below what you wanna see me do, what type of videos you wanna see me do on my channel, cause I already have a ton of ideas, but if I can see the stuff that you guys say, I'll know, I'm like, okay, they wanna see stuff like this, cause this is really fun. But anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video and wanna see more videos like this, make sure to push that like button that subscribe button that bell button ding thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys so much bye